The next poet is George Leong. George Leong is a student here, and then he dropped out, and now he's a student again at San Francisco State. He is the winner of the California Arts Council Arts and Community Fellowship for 1977. He is the co-founder of the San Francisco Asian American Writers Workshop, and he has a book coming out now. Do you have the book with you? No, it uh, should be out in a week or and so. And it's called A Lone Bamboo Doesn't Come from Jackson Street. It'll be published by Isthmus Press. <laughs> Gee, I, I'm, I'm so nervous today. Very good. Yeah, I hope so. Okay, well, I'll just take you to a kind of a recent time thing. And uh, let me lay out everything I'm going to do here. Because I have this thing about spilling everything I read on the floor. Okay, there's a thing that happened not too long ago um, in uh, Susanville. And, uh, okay, there's a prison up there, and there's a lot of like, antelope people over there. And there are a lot of uh, Native Americans in the prison there, too. And what happened, there's uh, the guards, and the, uh, the guards opened up, you know, and uh, tried to shoot a lot of people. And uh, when there's an investigation, a lot of the guards quit, and the uh, warden said he was on vacation. So uh, this is how it goes. Antelope killers for the antelope people. They're saying in Susanville that no one knew who shot the antelope. The killer, the killer claims he shot 100 rounds in eight hours, eight miles away, with his friends who said they hit out with Charles Bronson and John Way, the day it all happened, while challenging antelope prisoners with pieces and lies. The killer dares, truth means time, in the big hole, forever. A Senator X was afraid for the killer too, claims too many prisoners will run the streets if you tell a man when he can be free, not indeterminate. So I ask if your honor should lock yourself in for having no right to talk, a no way talking, honest, jive politician. History says politicians shot all the antelope and used them for a theme song with a deer and the antelope play. They shot all the antelope if they could and tried to throw the flesh away as if it was as easy as confetti on a New Year's parade.